All right, welcome back, everybody. And in this lesson, we are going to um, prepare for our um, destruction on a building. I'm going to show you how to create that, and we are going to put some debris behind our smoke. So, at first, let's just load up our debris. So, in your assets folder, um, you can find zero uh, zero two debris, and I got this from. Uh, from YouTube, uh, YouTube. I mean, from Google, and you put your color space to linear, so we can see all of our uh, our details. And I'm going to load up a, a roto, which I already have for you guys. And this is going to give you a nice clean alpha for the part we are going to use. So. Let's pre multiply this. And we have our nice debris. So, what we are going to do now is we are going to um, grade it down a little bit. Um, now, first, let's just put it in the back of our fire and smoke. So, back to our merge. We know, we know where this is. So, what we're going to do is we're going to create this card. And just to duplicate it. So now we have our card in the right space. Of course, it's below the ground. Uh, I don't think so, actually. It's looking nice. So, what I'm going to do for this one is I'm going to plug this in my merge geo and view this. So, put this a little bit in the back, move it to the middle. And we have our debris in the back. Look at it. Still, um, look, it's below the ground. So we go back to our uh, merge geo. Go, go to our card and move it up a little bit. Something like this, and we are going to scale it down. All right, and now we got our debris. We got our debris, and it looks like something is on fire. So let's grade it a little bit so it integrates better in the shot. So I'm just going to lift it a little bit up. If as you can see, if we lift it up, we get this weird. Square, so how to get rid of that is on premold by alpha. So I'm just going to put something like this and I'm going to gain it down and I'm going to gamma it up. I think it's too much. 1.2 looks, looks great. So now we got our nice debris. Of course, I'm going to put an S blur because it's way too sharp. I'm going to um, blur it by something like 10. All right, and I'm going to get rid of this blue, bluish. So what I'm going to do? I'm going to migrate, go to my gain, and go to my T M Y or I, I'm sorry, and put it a little bit to the so it looks like the fire is giving it a really orange feel. So before and after and it looks already more integrated in the shot. Alright. So we got our big um, debris and our smoke and now we are going to um, make it smoke a little bit more. So in my smoke I can grade my alpha channel and my smoke becomes darker and that's exactly what we want alright so this looks nice so we got our big smoke big smoke and our fire so I'm going to um, 
create the same, I'm going to use my same debris and put it in the back of this one. So easy stuff again, we don't have to copy the whole thing again, we can just copy our card. That's this one. Plug it in here and merge it in your Merge Geo. And it should be. Yep, there it is. Of course we have to reposition it. Go to your Merge Geo. Go to your card and plug it a little uh, put a little bit in the back and we can just scale it down a lot and put it in here and if you don't want to have the same look we can just scale it minus one and now it's rotated or mirrored and we got our debris so we know something is on fire we have this weird stuff over here so what we can do is just select your card select your card go to your Y and just move it up I think it's too much so we'll move this a little bit up yeah alright and if you look at it and it's a little really blurry so what are we going to do we're going to blur it also put it to focus in between our our card and put my defocus something like 3 and as you can see there's no difference why is there no difference we're going to figure it out what if we just bump it up it's taking a long time but here it is now it's doing stuff so we have to put it to something like 15 And now we got our fire that is blurry. It integrates much better in the background. And what's also great, if we look at our light wrap, all of our all of our objects has a light wrap. So it really helps to integrate our fire and smoke in this in the debris. All right. Uh, we are going to prepare for our. We're going to prepare for our uh, destruction on the building. So what we're going to do is we're going to our our camera tracker, uh, view our plate, and we're going to select all of these points because we know that this is in the right 3D space. Right select create a cylinder. Why not a card? Uh, because the object is a cylinder and we don't want to have a card that's floating around and doing all crazy stuff. So we're going to create a cylinder. Alright. In this cylinder uh, I'm selected, I'm going to create a checkerboard. I'm going to plug it in. And I'm going to plug it in my scene. And let's see what happens. If we look at our merge. As you can see our card is... Um, might be on the other ground, but I think it's just too big. It is a little bit on the ground, but it's way too big. So what I'm going to do, I'm just going to scale it down. Look at my points. I'm going to, as you can see, all of our points are in here. So we know this. We go to our top view. This is one. This is one, and this is one. So I'm going to move it a little bit to the back. Um, you don't have to be have to be really accurate as long as it works. You're okay. So we're gonna test it out right now. It's gonna load really long, so I'm going in my proxy mode. Yeah, it's better. And I'm going to my merge to something like 0.5. It's gonna affect these two, but no, no worries because we're going to use another um, scan line render and, and uh, re-render the whole thing with a destruction on the building. And then we're gonna put our foreground smoke. And after that's all done, we're gonna render it again because we want to uh, work fast. And we're gonna put our robot now foreground smoke. So that's how I usually work. I'm going to um, work on my far background. I'm going to work on my um, background, my midground, and then my foreground. All right. So we got our um, 
building over here and our cylinder and going to, I'm going to move it up a little bit so it's it fits in the right space and then I'm going to move it a little bit down all right so as you can see we have our our cylinder moving nicely with our background our building so we can just project a lot of stuff on here we can put like um, a logo we can destroy what we are going to do we can do a lot of stuff with it alright so in this lesson uh, we created our debris and put it in the right 3d space and I helped with integration and we prepared for our cylinder our building and we're going to in the next lesson we're going to work on the destruction of it all right and in between listen I will work uh, more on the f on the fire it's just the same stuff we did so um, in the next lesson you will see more fire and then we are going to work on our destruction on the building all right I see you in the next lesson